This video shows a vision and a reality. A machine that gets quickly and easily to the field using fly-by-wire coordinated steering. Matched front and rear steer mean the vehicle can comfortably negotiate a restricted access and make a smooth transition to its wide span field mode. Here a centre turn lines the driver up with the field boundary which forms the basis of a grid pattern that ensures the wheels impact only around 5% of the cropped area. As the driver follows the edge of the field, the outer wheels lay down a clear mark. On reaching the starting point, two pirouette and automated turns managed by satellite guidance Place the driver in line with this mark, which when followed, provides a further line for subsequent guidance. When working the body of a field, headland turns consist of a series of pirouettes, meaning that headlands suffer less compaction than they do with the existing equipment. During each pirouette, the wheels are steered through around 15 degrees, meaning minimum stationary time and soil damage. The unique wide-span pattern of operation overcomes the awkwardness experienced by traditional machines when they meet an angled headland. This vehicle can make a smooth transition between one pass and the next without compromising its normal pattern of manoeuvre and without increasing compaction on the headland. Structured manoeuvres around obstacles such as trees, pylons or ponds also mean that the driver doesn't have to make difficult judgments about too much avoidance or too little, leading to collision. Once the initial pattern has been laid down, determined by the shape and extent of the obstacle, the driver only needs to follow the wheel tracks on subsequent passes. Where previous working is intercepted, automated spray line section control or implement manipulation is initiated to avoid double working. The distinctive and minimal tracking laid down by a widespan vehicle system complements its efficiency in other respects. Acting as a sophisticated tool carrier which precludes duplication of engine, transmission and driver's cabin, it lowers the cost and weight of implements which can be employed at part or full span without compromising vehicle stability. Overall the wide span system is one that cannot be matched for efficiency, flexibility and soil protection, making it the most environmentally friendly and sustainable system that can presently be perceived. It moves agriculture to the next generation in mechanisation, replacing the traditional tractor concept that has remained unchanged since its beginning in the early 1900s.